The, the basic idea behind our research is that we're trying to detect people that appear suspiciously frequently across a variety of crowd scenes. And these crowd scenes might take place, say, at a riot location, or they might involve people watching the aftermath of arson or various other crime incidents. The basic idea behind the software that we've written is to automatically pick out people that appear in multiple scenes under the idea that we're trying to help face examiners identify people that they might not know they should be interested in, but maybe they should be. We want to help them do their job by making their job quicker and reducing the amount of data that they need to wade through in order to get at face images that they might be able to identify. This idea came to me in a meeting in Washington when someone was talking about some activities in the Middle East. But it was a year or so later before we got a chance to follow up on it. It's actually longer than a, a year after the meeting. And I cannot remember the name of the person or the agency that they, you know, we're in a conference table with 40 people, and honestly, some of whom do not wear name badges. And so it may be that I was never given the name of the person. But my memory is that this problem was motivated by people describing IED uh, bombings in the, in the Middle East and, and the problem of how do you find out who's doing them and how do you prevent them. At least our particular work on this was motivated from that meeting. But it was sometime later before we were able to put together an effort to follow up.